In this video, we're going to evaluate a polynomial using the remainder theorem. It says, which function has a remainder of negative 132 when divided by x plus 2? Well, the remainder theorem states that if a polynomial f of x is divided by x minus k, the remainder is f of k. So if it's divided by some factor, with the 0 being k, then the remainder is f of k, or f of that 0. Well, if we look at our problem here, we have k is equal to negative 2. And it tells us that the remainder is negative 132, so that's really f of k. Which, if I combine these together, that really tells us that uh, f of negative 2 should be negative 132. So what I need to do is I need to check each of these functions to see if when I plug in negative 2, I get negative 132. So I'm going to take the first one, which would be 3, negative 2 cubed, minus 2 times negative 2 squared, plus 2 times negative 2, plus 30, and I'm going to see what it equals. Uh, so I've got negative 24 here. This would be negative 2 squared is 4, so minus 8, minus 4 more, and then plus 30. So I get negative 6, which is not negative 132, so this one is out. Just going to put a dash there. Then we try the next one, 2, negative uh, 2 cubed minus 20, negative 2 squared, plus 2 times negative 2, plus 3. So negative 2 cubed is going to be negative 8, times the 2 is negative 16. So we have negative 16. This would be 4 times this, that's negative 80. Minus 4, and then plus the 3. You get negative 97, which again is not negative 132. So then you're going to plug in 3, negative 2 cubed, minus 20, negative 2 squared, plus 29, times negative 2, plus 30. When you do negative 2 cubed, that's negative 8, times the 3, that's negative 24. This would be 4 times the negative 20, that's negative 80 minus uh, 58 plus 30. If I put all those together, negative 24 minus 80 minus 58 plus 30, I get negative 132. So this is the function that has a remainder of negative 132 when divided by x plus 2.